Hello, I'm Ashima. I work for Puro as Head of Property Safety Services. And this week's hot topic is how we keep you, your family and any visitors or friends that you have to your property safe. Myself and my team will explain to you what services that we do, what checks that we do and how you can contact us and how we will contact you. We cover a range of property safety items, including passenger lifts, uh, asbestos, fire safety, gas, trade on, stair lifts in your property, electric safety in your property. We also cover a lot of checks in the communal areas. So please don't get worried if you see somebody, a contractor or one of our own Kira employees in your communal area doing some checks. But please be mindful that we will be phoning you up to make appointments so that we can come and visit your property to make sure it's safe for your home. I'd like you to like to introduce you to Dan and Katie, who are members of my team, who will go through a range of little questions that I'm sure you've got on what you can do to help yourselves and what we can do to help you to make sure that your property is safe. Over to you. Okay. Hello, so my name's Dan. So <laughs> I'm actually calling from my car at the moment. Um, I'm currently on site at one of our properties in Minerva Court where we're installing a series of fire doors. I was previously in the office, but, but <laughs> all the residents kind of come and have a chat to me right the way throughout and the workmen are a bit noisy. So I'm doing the call from here. Um, so yeah, let's say a little bit more. Um, so we have various contractors, as Ashima kind of explained. And we also have our own sort of internal contractors, which are doing a lot of works as well. So we're doing works all year round to keep your, to keep your homes nice and safe and to make sure that our obligations as a landlord are fulfilled. Um, lockdown has certainly proved challenging. A lot of works had stopped for a time, but we're certainly keeping, or well, making sure that all the important necessary works are maintained even throughout this challenging period. Um, we're now looking to contact a lot of our customers, you guys, to rearrange a lot of appointments for those things that were missed during the period that we were in lockdown. Um, so please look out for those calls fairly soon. Uh, our contracts have been taking a lot of precautions during the lockdown for the works that are still going ahead and we will still be continuing to take those precautions. So as a customer, you'll get a phone call from one of us or our contractors letting you know that we need to do some work in your property or just check a piece of equipment. We need you to make that appointment so that we can make sure everything is safe or complies with the law. Um, so you'll receive a call from us in Curo or our appointed contractors. Um, and we'll arrange a mutually convenient time that we can both meet you and make sure everything is safe and sound. We normally book this over the phone or send a letter in the post, but text messages are also sent the day before the appointment as a reminder. Katie, shall I hand over to you? Yes, hello everyone. So, a little less interesting than Dan, I'm still working from home, as of most of our team. Um, but I deal with the administration side, so it will most likely be one of um, myself or one of my other colleagues that may contact you to make you aware if an appointment is needed. Um, equally, our contractors will do so as well. At this time, um, we're giving you these little tips to just make sure that you are staying safe um, within your home and that it is as safe as possible. But this video can be used all year round in every home that you have. Um, it's not just now, um, things are being used a lot more now, so you might notice things start to get um, a little bit more run down, maybe that switch doesn't work anymore, or maybe that light needs checking. Um, so yeah, those are the sorts of things that you'll start to notice, and our contractors are on hand to make sure that they are as safe as they can. Um, equally, if you have any communal areas uh, around your home, maybe communal hallways or lobbies, you might notice that the fire alarm is going off and being checked once a week now because you may not have been there before. Equally, some of the communal lighting might be on and they might be doing a test. So if you ever see anything and you think, oh, I wonder what they're doing, just give us a call um, on our usual number and then we'll be able to answer any queries that you have. That's right. And Dan, do you want to go through our usual number and how they can contact us? Yeah, absolutely. Um, so to contact our customer contact team, the phone number is, it's going to appear here, <laughs> 01225 
0123663600. So that's 0122536600. Um, but you can also contact us on our live chat via our website or through our MyCuro portal. Um, you may be asked to perform a couple of checks when we do give you a call or something. Just little quick things, as Katie mentioned before. So say, checking you've got credit on your meter or checking that a fuse board hasn't checked or something simple like that. Brilliant. Thank you, Dan and Katie. And just to add that if you are worried about social distancing or whether the contract is taking precautions or how COVID or any uh, sort of situation during this time is going to be covered, uh, please note that when the contractor calls, they'll always have an ID card. We'll always call beforehand. And if you have any questions, please just ask us then. But all our contractors and all of our staff that come and visit you will have the appropriate sort of protective wear. You know, you've seen us all out and about wearing either mask or glass. Um, we have our wipes on hand as well. We may ask you to open the windows or maybe go to another room to make sure that you're not um, going to be caught out with the coronavirus or that, you know, we might need you to go and take a break outside of the lobby so that we've got a bit more space to do some works internally. But if you've got any concerns, please don't hesitate when we do contact you to ask us questions or just to say, look, I'm really worried. What, what do you think about this? And we have no problems with answering any of your concerns or issues or any questions. Hopefully uh, through this period, you'll see what we do do around the buildings and blocks to make sure that you're kept safe. And you will understand that maybe we'll try to come down and see if it, make sure everything's okay. Thank you.